everybody, welcome back to the vlog. In this episode, I'm doing What's in My Camera Bag 2022 edition. So, the camera bag that I use is this one, and how I've got everything organized, you can really do it with just about any camera bag as long as you've got enough space. I've got all my stuff organized into various cubes. With this particular bag that I have, I have about two cubes and about a half for some miscellaneous stuff and we'll get into those. So what is always in my bag kind of no matter what and so I have a lot of various cubes that each have a particular style of equipment that I would need for a particular shoot. But one of the cubes is pretty much always permanently in my camera as well as a couple other accessories. So, what's permanently in my camera is my first cube, and that's the cube that contains my Canon EOS R. Most of the time, just for ease of use, I will have it with the 50mm lens on because that actually fits perfectly into the camera bag itself, both into the cube portion. With that one, I've got a small rig cage attached to it as well as my black rapid strap that goes across my body so since it's a small rig it's got uh, all of the connecting points and i do have two handles that i use for when i need to go out and do actual video footage just to have a little bit more grip onto the camera so that those shots are a little smoother along with that i've also got the Rode Video Micro, which is going to be the microphone that I use for most of these vlog videos. A couple batteries, and then my uh, Delkin devices is SD card holder. So I have a fair number of those, and I have one in each of my digital camera cubes. The reason that this is my main cube that is always in is the fact that it has two side pouches and a top pouch, which I usually have an extra SD card, as well as the base plate for the, for the tripods, and a little converter that I can use for attaching stuff to a small rig cage on various points of the camera. One of the things that is always in my camera bag is this bag that I have of that's actually a lens pouch. Uh, but I've used it now to hold a couple pocket wizards and a couple extra batteries. And then as well, as of late, on the outside of the camera uh, bag, I will now keep uh, my little GoPro pouch oh, in it as well. And that's got a GoPro with a tripod and then a couple various accessories and charging cable. And then of course on the side of the bag I've got my Gorillapod attached and in the little pouch uh, i've got some wireless bluetooth headphones my vaccination card and my multi-tool and then like i said from here on out the rest of these rotate with whatever i will be needing for that particular shoot so the first one is my portable lighting setup that one i've got a couple led tubes which are actually right now set up behind me two of them like I have two smaller ones and then those also with that have a little connector to screw ooh, them together to make them a longer tube and then a longer tube which also has connectors on either side for if I want to connect and make one big long tube like I did for the shoot that I the light painting shoot that I did with amber then I've got uh, two speed lights. They're just cheap newer -er ones. Um, I got them for like 40 bucks. Uh, nice and simple, but they all, but they, they work really effectively. And, and in those particular cases, they have the right connections that I can use those with my pocket wizards. One of the next packs is my Polaroid -ed camera, as well as a couple little packs. Usually I've got the rest of them in cold storage and I just have a couple 
in the bag ready to go in case I end up shooting through a pack so I have one as a backup. And then with that one, this one will rotate depending what I need. Uh, currently right now it's my Ilford Sprite 2. This particular setup I can have my Holga with, I can have either of my other film cameras as in here uh, just because it has enough space with the Polaroid camera for one additional film camera. And then obviously I have the rest of the film in the fridge it's being stored as well and just keep an extra roll at least um, in here at pretty much at all times uh, just in case I were to run out. And then the other one is my extra digital old bag. This one has my Canon 80D, a few batteries, again the Delkin devices, uh, SD card holder, and some, and a base plate for the tripod because I never know. A lot of times this will be, on wrestling shows, this will be what I use to set up the time lapse, so the base plate always being in the in the secondary A1 is always very beneficial. Um, then lastly, it's kind of my auxiliary bag. Currently, right now, it is uh, it has my uh, Canon K2 as well as my Nikon FM10, kind of just so that they're in some place where I know where they are so I can have them stored. Hopefully this helped everybody understand kind of the type of equipment that I use and the type of equipment if you're looking for stuff to get um, that is very beneficial to use for yourself. And hopefully this gave you some ideas. Make sure to like and subscribe on this channel and follow me on all social media at Knocked Out Films. Thanks.